what's up it's Friday it's Friday I love a Friday when I don't have to work on Saturday <clears throat> and this will happen this week I get to go to a wedding which usually I don't get to enjoy because I always have to photograph the wedding but this weekend I get to go to the wedding cut loose hang out with some friends and uh, I'm pumped uh, may head up to the horse races for a little bit lose some money which is always a good time well I got a little more sleep than I thought I would last night um, I did have one slight wake up and had to kind of uh, clear my mind by going to the refrigerator grabbing me a gallon of milk and making a peanut butter sandwich and eating it at about 3 a.m. That always makes any overweight male happy. Okay. At an auction, it's the only place you can find the most random stuff next to Walmart, side by side. Like this. Fish fryer. Theater lighting. Fish fryer. Air conditioner unit. Air compressor. Check out the commons area of the auction. Oh man, this right here, this right here has got to be mine. Check it out. Easy there, buddy. Is there anything you can live without? Yeah, I want that blue couch. For what? For the studio, dude. You know how much that cost? How much? Five bucks. You'll leave here with that for no more than ten bucks. Woo! What kind of phone you got? This is my, this is my, my uh, flip don't, camera, don't my vlog. Right this what is, is my, my video log of the day. Oh, oh, is this for today? We're on the air live at Southwestern <laughs> Oklahoma State University. We're not on the air. Well, we're just taking <laughs> pictures, having fun. My friend Anthony Butler has recently been uh, stopped by Rick Bowler, chief of police at Southwestern, for stealing a lot of things that are going to be shipped to Africa for poor kids <laughs> that aren't going to make ends meet. And I think it's absolutely horrible. But since we're friends, we're going to let him take it all. <laughs> yeah, thanks. <laughs> Triceratops living the tough life of a studio bunny. Come here. Come on, T Tops. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna hurt you. I just wanted to pet you. It's pretty sad when the bunny rabbit that you support with carrots and love doesn't let you touch him unless you have food this is another example of why my rabbit is spoiled because <laughs> he gets bottle fed <laughs> this is also another reason why we don't get anything done at work it's because Danny's either on her iPhone or feeding no. the bunny God, he's scared. of course I scare his ass off I rub my head like this a lot in my videos. Do I do this all the time? Yeah. I almost love my head. <laughs> You're like his corner man. You're like, come in and get some come in and get some nutrients and drink this water. T-tops. Now my bunny has hopped onto the Bella Hay. So I just got in a package. I've been waiting for about three days. Um, it's a sweet ass gambling game, which you'll see on the vlog throughout the year. Uh, let's check it out. All right, that is the put and take top. It's wonderful. People who don't know how to gamble or don't have uh, the abilities to to count, uh, <laughs> but you just spin the top. Oh sh crap! That didn't work out too good. You spin the top like so, and then. When it falls, 
not off table hopefully. Okay, that's a bad example, but it tells you to pay one. So you just do what, do what the top tells you to do. It's the most awesome game in the entire world. If you want to know where to get one at, holler at me and I will tell you the website. Actually, tell you what, I won't tell you the website because the website link over here, sidebar. Check it out. All right, guys, what's up? So, I was sitting here thinking today, how can I make my vlog a little different than the other vlogs uh, on YouTube or blogs on the internet or whatever? And uh, I see that Che Carl has Discussion Wednesday, which uh, gets a lot of responses. And um, uh, Philip DeFranco has his um, Thursday something, same kind of type deal as as Shay Carl has, and I'm gonna go with reasons to party for every day of the year. I figure I'm doing this for a year, I might as well give you a reason to party every day of the year. And uh, so I'm gonna do the day, the next day every day. So like today's April 24th, I'm gonna do the reason to party for April 25th, seeing how I'm gonna be posting these up the next day. Um, the reason to party for April 25th is that Elvis Presley, Heartbreak Hotel hit number one in 1956. Now, I don't like Elvis Presley. I think he stole the music from all the black musicians and made money as they all got broke. But that's my own opinion. What's your opinion? You like Elvis? I mean, whatever. I don't care. But I still will use that for a reason in order to have a party. So, that's the reason for April 25th to get hammered or do whatever you do when you party. Uh, we keep updating these every day for the next year. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. It sounds dumb when I say stay tuned.